in the name of Allah, the most beneficent, the most merciful. Scientific breakthroughs allow now allow mankind to clone species readily. This has been this has been shown clearly with Dolly the sheep and many other examples. Science is providing more and more explanations for things that were not previously only attributed to God. Do you have a response? There's a common mantra which is actually very true. Science explains how and not why. And it's very simplistic, but it's very true. Science only explains the mechanisms. It cannot explain why these mechanisms are the way that they are. And if you look at the theory of evolution, uh, again, and the, and, and the issue of cloning as well comes under that, that you can explain scientifically causa causation, you can explain how species uh, form, how mutations occur, but you cannot explain why they happen. You cannot explain the power that these genes have. Where did they get that power from to replicate and a few replications are going to be incorrect and, and some of them will then become standard. We believe la hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. What does that translate as? Think about it. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. Nothing changes. Hala hawla means to change. Nor is there any inherent power in anything except from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. No gene has the power to replicate. Right? No cell can, can perform a photosynthetic transformation in itself unless and until Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala basically allows it to occur. And therefore, yes, we can clone species. And that is you simply take a particular DNA and then replicate it and put it into what is going to become an embryo or, or a, a type of you know, germination and then allow it to germinate. But you haven't created life. You have not created that DNA. Only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is al-khaliq. We have learned to Xerox photocopies of species. This is cloning. We can take it. We've invented the mechanism to replicate it. Real creation would be start from scratch and bring forth something if you're able to do that. And we know we cannot do that. We can only take the creation of Allah and change it here and there, add things here and there. We can never start from scratch. That is what really brings about divine powers. Kun fayakun. We can never do that. Allah knows best.